I'm here with Ravi and Gita of Meet the Patels. I feel like, like I know you guys. You know, <laughs> that everyone just uh, come up to you and say, you're like my brother, you're like my sister. You know, they don't come up to us, they come up to our parents. Actually. They run up to our parents. No one talks to us. <laughs> <laughs> our parents are like celebrities to anyone who's seen the movie. Are they really? Oh, last night we were at this party and with our parents, and this girl from across the party <laughs> sees dad, and I saw it, because I didn't, I thought it, like maybe she was sick or something, because she just looks over and she goes, and it was like in slow motion, and she, she it was runs so cool. towards our dad. And dad was scared. He just was kind of like, you know, like he, he thought there was some kind of like, you know, event about to happen. Oh, man. But, uh, he didn't it was but he's such a friendly guy. He takes it all in. It's great. Yeah. How about mom? Well, she she a little more reserved. She's loving it. No, no, no. She's they're both bubbly. They're both you know they're just the life of the party. So they're they're having a great time. They love people. They love talking to people. So yeah. it's it's really weird and surprising because I don't think we we didn't plan anything really. I mean this whole everything about this film was unplanned. So it's really lovely when it's meant to be which is what it feels like you know they they give a lot of advice to people they always have and it just feels like this is a continuation right. so, so now a question that baits a question they love giving advice have you guys stopped taking the advice or do you <laughs> has it gotten to that point yet well it's important from a health perspective yeah. to uh have some degree of discretion on how much advice you take yeah. so we definitely we definitely let some stuff filter through. But they say, they tell us a lot of good things, actually. I mean, they're really, we actually do really respect them, and they're smart. Yeah, I think, I think we still follow their advice at some level, but we know, we've learned how to take their advice also. I think that's part of growing up for us, is to hear our own voices and their voices, not just their voices. Yeah. Yeah. Was it difficult when you were thinking of uh, the documentary that you were going to reveal so much of yourselves? What, was it... Any type of trepidation? Well, you know, I'm going to be talking about my relationships. We're going to be talking about our parents, and they're going to be revealing stuff about us. You know, any moment of hesitation? Yeah, I'm sure on Gita's end, there was a lot of hesitation, all that behind the camera work that she was going to be doing. Uh, but yeah, of course, I mean, we're making a film about our lives. I mean, I, I was actually comfortable once I thought that this thing was an important film to make and that it could potentially impact some people's lives. I was like, oh, well. I don't think I have that much to hide, and worst case, I just get to hopefully see myself on camera and make some tweaks. But um, I think we were more so really protective of putting our family out there and putting our close friends out there and making sure that we were hopefully, you know, when they watch the movie, we want all these people that are in it to love it too because we don't want to feel like we betrayed them. Yeah. I agree. <laughs> Ditto. <laughs> you know, as, you, as you're watching the film, you see you, um, you have a breakup, then you go through this process, and then you go to India, and your father's showing you the map of the you know, specific area he wants you to you know, focus on. And right. one of the thoughts that came to my mind was gene pool. You know, yeah. it's, it's, it's a small area that's, you know, <laughs> did yeah. that ever cross your mind through this process? You know? you know expand that a little bit <laughs> <laughs> yeah in fact i asked my dad in the movie i'm like uh but some of these people might be related right he's like ah maybe <laughs> and i'm like um maybe yeah i mean a lot of people are married within you know this is my cousin's cousin's cousin or this is my all of that happens and and there's a pride that goes with that because they feel like the culture is the same the upbringing is the same and for us, it's bizarre because we're living in, a, a, you know, cities where we don't do that anymore. But, you know, it feels like every civilization started in that to some extent, which is a whole other, you know, conversation. But, but uh, I, I think, yeah, we, we think about that and we, I think this film has helped us come to terms with all that, you know. If we, you know, that'd be a big conversation. Did you have that conversation with them, you know, more extensive? You know, you know we could be literally just only a couple generations away from each other cousins did they ever answer that in depth <laughs> no because i know there's plenty of safeguards in it that keep it from being incestuous it's more of a joke than anything else uh so we joke about it but it's not a real risk i mean you know the, they all descend from this area in india and yeah they're all last name patel and so conceptually it seems like that but patels are one of the largest clans in the world so while it all started there we we're spread all over the world and so now it's generations far enough and uh but yeah it's definitely it's definitely funny when you think about it purely in terms of that place where they all come from 
Lawrence Wolf. Uh, one, of the th one of the themes I picked up from the movie was, you're, you're both born here, Americans, and you speak American. And I think that really added an element to the, uh, to the movie. D did you do that purposefully, or was it just you were just being yourselves? I think that's what helped connect it um, to an American audience. You know, because right. I was watching, oh, they're, they're just, you know, Americans, you know, just <laughs> traveling, you know, learning about their past and their families. Yeah. Was that purposeful, or was it just you guys were just talking to each other? I think we're just no. being ourselves. Yeah, we're just know? being ourselves. I mean, the thing about this film that's been really fun is that it's just us being us. You know, there's been no... Not, nothing has been set up, it's, and yeah, it's all natural. We, we speak English, we speak our language. So now I have to ask, Robbie, the, the biggest uh, dating advice that you've gotten so far from people who've seen the film? <laughs> best dating advice I've heard from people who have seen the film. Yeah, what is the best date? That's a very really good question. Uh, you, tell you, next. you know, <laughs> I'll give you a quote that was just sent to me today. It said that dating is like finding a parking spot. You always are going to ask yourself, is it close enough? <laughs> and I read that to my dad. He goes, yep. <laughs> that is right. Send it to your sister. She needs to hear that one. <laughs> uh, that, that's pretty good. You, you that's pretty good advice for you too. Um, close one. Yeah, it is, that's good advice. I, I think we live in. That. I think we live in a time where we're all so over inundated with choice that we're all pickier about every facet of our lives. You know, as you know, the movie is great. You have animation in it. You have you know cultures, both cultures here and you know in, in India. What would you like the audience to walk away with? You know, the Indian uh, audience, the American audience. You know, what do you think they'll pick up from it? The pickup of the audience, like yeah, what, what do you want people to? What was the takeaway of the film? Yeah, takeaway. I think uh, the overall takeaway is, is family and relationships. How you deal with your relationships. Um, it's weird holding this with you. Why don't I just take it, it for weird. a minute? Yeah. Um, you know we're how you handle. Married. Yeah, we're not married. Yeah. Uh, uh, not a couple. <laughs> not together. Uh, how you handle your relationships. You know, just getting along and uh, trying, always trying, and 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 just never giving up on each other and kind of fighting fighting uh, discourse with love. Same, so. same thing, Robbie? Uh, yeah, I would say the same thing. So, hey, look, it, that's what's great about the film. It's entertaining, it's about family, and it's really about just like having a transparent relationship with your parents, and we're doing the work to get through stuff. Fantastic. Yeah. Well, thank you very much. It was a thank great you so film, much. and congratulations. Thank you very much for having you us. Bet. Thanks for you having bet. us.